Hello guys, today I want to show you how to record your vocals in FL Studio. So, um, let's go with um, something like this. Let's say you have uh, your beat already uploaded. Let me just drag this. Let's say you use the beat on the first channel. So, uh, the next thing you need to do is just to actually make sure that uh, for me, this is the sound card I'm using. Uh, that's the input I'm using. It's Focusrite. So uh, it's on Focusrite USB ASIO. Uh, you don't need to bring it to any of these places. Uh, I think your based on your sound card, based on your your in, based on the interface you are using, uh, you just need to use this. So for mine, it's uh, Focusrite USB ASIO yes that is it so the next thing you need to do is uh, to check to right click on this uh, record button here when you right click make sure that uh the tick uh, the audio here is tick that that means uh, you are going to be recording audio so the next thing you need to do is uh this is in fl studio 21 all you need to do is to right click on this track 2 come to track mode audio track let's say let's use uh since the channel one has our beat let's say the channel two is for the recording so you click on insert channel two once you click on insert channel two automatically as you can see it has automatically routed uh your the channel or your playlist to the channel on your mixer channel so that means channel two on your mixer channel then you just need to come to this place and click on this none and none uh the input on my uh where the my mic has been uh, the, the input of my mic on my sound card is on uh input one that's left so i'm going to be using input one for this as you can hear uh as you can hear this is it that's actually that's actually picked and it's actually showing you here that uh, i'm talking so Whenever you come to record, you could actually see that this is actually happening. That means your mic is on. So uh, there are a few things you need to know about this. Uh, so this is the record button here. You could actually remove the record button, uh, bring it back. That means before you record, make sure this is on. And um, as you can hear, there is, as you can see, there is a feedback here. That means you will be hearing whatever you say or whatever is happening. Uh, close to your mic in the headphones so if you don't want that you could actually click on this once you click it brings out this dialog box and the next thing you need to do is to switch it off as you can see now uh it's off you can't actually hear a feedback to your headphones so for now you are good to go to record so once you are ready to record you could actually as you can see this is once i keep uh, my mouse pointer here it tells me here you can see this the hint panel it says type in keyboard to piano so we don't want to uh, uh do the uh, we don't want to use our uh, system keyboard uh, as our piano so we remove this that means when i click when i press r it's for recording when i press the r again it removes the recording so if you want to record now you could actually do like this r and then you hit your uh space uh space bar or your keyboard or that's or your computer keyboard as you can see as you can see it has recorded this is our recording yes and it's perfect but sometimes uh maybe you record let's say let's record again let me just remove this so let's say let's say let us record with a lower uh input from the mic so let's say we've recorded and then um, as you can see let me zoom as you can see it's showing a very low uh sign from the waveform so you could actually just right click and you know normalize as you can see when you normalize that's come so 
wherever you are putting your effects for the recording or your mixer channel you could actually just right click and just send it to that channel let's say it's on channel 3 so it's on channel 3 right now and when i play it you could see it on channel 3 as you can see our vocal is on channel 3 and don't forget also to actually put your beat on channel 1 so as to so as to see the the, the level of the beat and actually reduce it to normal okay so this is perfect so this is actually how to record don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel so this is actually how um you record on fl on fl studio you record your vocals on fl studio i will bring you more tips and more tutorials for you very simple tips explained in simple languages and simple terms for you to understand don't forget to like subscribe and drop your comments below thank you